right, in this tutorial, we're going to create a footer for your WordPress websites with the Sydney theme. Do you guys click footer links? I don't know. I do. I really click those links down at the bottom, whether it's on Amazon or my favorite blog. Maybe I just need to find some last minute information. I think people will really click in the footer. Um, and so that's why we're going to create a beautiful footer. And uh, let's get started. So come on up to the customize button and click customize. And now we're going to click on footer right there. So here we can select the number of widget areas you want, like the number of columns, one, two, three, four, whatever we want will be in our footer. And because the blog has three columns and it's right above the footer, we're going to stick with three so that it looks, you know, symmetrical. And now we can just click on widgets and we can click footer one and click add widget. All right. And the first widget we want to add is really simple. It's just the site origin editor, a rich text editor we're going to create an about us section using this widget. In the title, I'm just going to write in Sydney theme. And then I'm just going to talk about what our website does right here as a way to introduce our website to people again in the footer. All right, so once that's ready, you can just click close and it will save itself all right and there we have our first widget it's not the most beautiful widget ever but sometimes keeping it simple is the most important thing and it's nice that sydney sets us up with this background color already so let's move on and add another widget we can go back and now we have footer two and three available because we started off and we added some content to footer one. So it knows that we might want footer two. We can click footer two and add widget. And now I'm just gonna go with a list of our contact info, display your contact info. All right, so that's pretty similar to what we put on our contact page, but you never know where people are gonna look to contact you and if they can't find it, then they're not gonna be happy. We have to keep visitors happy. So we'll call this contact us. If we click on the contact page, we get that information and we can just copy paste it from there. So we like doing that, saving ourselves some time. And once you paste it in the last of your contact info, just click close and it will save automatically and the nice little icons come up too. So we can go back now and open up footer three and click add a widget. And the last thing we're gonna add is just a Sydney FP call to action. All right, and we're gonna use this button to get people to other parts of the site. So let's start filling it in. We can make the title work with us and the call to action, get started on your next project with our help. And then a little link for the button. We can come up and right click on the R work tab, copy that link address and paste it in the link. And then the title can be the text that goes inside the button. Get a quote for free. Perfect. So when that's ready, we can choose to display the button inline if you want, but it looks a little better the other way. So we can just save and publish now that we're ready to go with our footer. All right, now let's X out and see what we made. And let me go all the way down. We see we have a nice looking footer.